so let's try another one of these. Um, so let's say I'm still sticking with the identity of female college professors, and I want to try a different type of media. I'm going to try news stories. So I'm just going to type in female college professors news and see what I get. So I get an, a news story from NPR about why female professors get lower ratings. I get a news story about a professor who um, is talking about fake news websites. Um, here's another news report looking at the status of women in higher education. Ooh, this is a good one. Hottest professors in the Huffington Post. So I'm finding some great um, news articles about female professors. So these could be really great. Rate my professor data shows student gender bias against uh, female professors. Yeah, so these would also be great pop culture artifacts. The news stories themselves, I could look at these and then notice, well, what are the stories being told about women college professors? And um, so let's just open this one and look at it. So I could analyze the picture that accompanies this news story. I could analyze the form, the format, uh, the language, the audience. I could look at all this stuff and analyze that. So that looks like a great source. So let's try another tack. Maybe I want to look at college, female college professors and I want to look at Twitter. So here I find a Twitter feed from a female college professor. I could analyze that, her Twitter feed. Um, here's one. Patrice on Twitter, 30 most influential college professors on Twitter. So that, let's see what that is. So this is a guide to traditional and not traditional online degree programs. So this looks like, I'm not even sure what this thing is. Have to look, I'd have to look more deeply into what this is, um, if it's somebody's blog or what it is. But So that's, that's possible. Um, but since I don't really know what that is, I, I might steer clear of that. But these other things, like these uh, Twitter feeds, these could be great. These are actually written by a female college professor, supposedly. So I could, I could analyze her Twitter feed. Anyway. So the, the, that's some examples of how you use Google to track down particular pop culture artifacts that you might use to analyze for your project.